So this is what happened when Richard Hammond was dropped into a deep freezer. I am now marooned here. Wherever the hell here is, the watch has now sent my exact location to a highly trained search and rescue team. What is that? Oh, I think this is the signal from Richard Hammond. We really do need to get on this, James. So, could we see the pudding menu? I'm a television presenter from Birmingham, not Beth Grill. You missed the last fight out today. Have we? Yeah. Oh, what a rotten bit of luck. Coming to get you, Hammond. Hammond! Oh, I'm back! Oh. Sorry, Hammond, we're not going to be able to make it. You know what? You know what's going to be really funny? When that goes out, I, I won't give away how long Richard was out there, but it was a long time. Wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> what will be really funny is that, thanks to some other television presenters who we now know fake things, everybody will say to Richard, you weren't really up there all that time by yourself. But how far down the list would these two be? of the least person, the least people you want to be rescued by. If it were an infinitesimally long yeah. list, still it, you can't get far enough down for where their names would be. I on. don't think it's giving too much away to say that James and I didn't rush. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's fair enough, isn't it, James? We I, didn't. Yeah, I think It was that's... when we got to the point and they were saying, well, we could... Because we were in London when we got the message that he was in Western Canada. And, um, and we remained there for some time. We were still yeah, in we London several days yeah, later. Yeah. And genuinely, he was on the... I know he was. Yeah. He, uh, he was in his little makeshift, sh uh, makeshift uh, shelter on the mountain. And it got to the point when somebody said that we could fly Delta, and I said, no, I don't like their seat upholstery. <laughs> so it was, we were down to that level of excuse. Right. Wow. Yeah, well, there was one flight they offered us, but it went from Gatwick. And oh, I it... hate Gatwick. No. I just can't stand it. <laughs> so, and, and the watch... It, does it really, like an action man, yeah. you pull it out? Yeah, it sends a little, little signal out. It yeah. sends a signal to a, a normal circumstance. It sends it to an international rescue type deal. You then contact the nearest proper search and rescue team who will go and get you. The fine for pulling it out while drunk at your golf club is enormous. Is. But they will come and rescue you if you're stuck. But we just asked the international rescue people, in, instead of getting Canadian Air Sea Rescue to go and get him to tell us. To get you and we were having an agreeable lunch at a Polish restaurant in London. <laughs> and we weren't going to rush that one, were we, James? Okay. No.